Hi, I'm Toto Wolf, the team principal of the Mercedes Petronas Formula One team. Normally the pure pit wall is done by the really intelligent engineers, but this time you guys, the fans, have requested for me to do it. So yeah, let's do it. Let's lower the standard for the last race in Abu Dhabi. That's a very good question. Normally during the season you would say, let's save some engine mileage and um, not go all the way to the end and also benefit from a tire choice. Um, but this time it was the last race of the season and we wanted to give Valtteri a shot for pole position. He has performed really well most recently. And also in terms of tire choices, there were not a lot of options open after using the medium anyway in Q2. So we thought out and out race of Valtteri, let's go for pole position and uh, see what he can achieve. The beginning of the race for the ones that missed it there were 18 laps where nobody actually had some drs it was some kind of technical glitch i think probably somebody in race control uh, stumbled over cable and it wasn't properly plugged in the wall but uh, yeah it was not great for valtteri because he couldn't progress through the field like we would have imagined and maybe he could have had a shot for P3 at the end, he was very close to Charles, but it is what it is. P4 on the road, which is really strong considering that he came from last. It was a spectacular pit stop, 2.11, uh, so one of the fastest we did this season. And uh, I stood there uh, watching the guys because I'm always uh, blown away by the consistency of these stops. Particularly for us, we're not aiming to beat any pit stop records because there ain't no points for pit stop records, but about delivering consistent stops. I think generally when, you, when you're out in front and you're able to manage the pace, uh, it gives you a great advantage. Uh, following another car is what really, what really makes the tires suffer. But uh, Lewis controlled the race um, from the get-go and therefore he was, he was able to extract such an amazing time at the end on the hard tire. We have seen a similar performance in Silverstone. Uh, so, in a way, he's able to really feel the grip and uh, maintain the grip until uh, uh, when the car is much lighter and he can score that extra point. That's such a stupid question that can only come from our own social media department. So, yes, uh, for everybody who wants to know, they are being stress tested. And uh, next time, we use the guy who invented the question for stress testing. Yeah, I don't know what you can do uh, with the next 100 days. I mean, there's Christmas in between and uh, New Year, so there's a good reason for having a drink or a night out and then for a few days to recover. For us, there is not a lot of time left because the factory is on a 12-month shift, basically. When we're not racing, we are building up the cars and putting them together and trying to catch up. Uh, with all the regular office stuff. So not a lot of not a lot of partying going on for us, but I hope you at least can can enjoy the time uh, over the festive period. Thank you for asking all the questions on Pure Pitwall. It was nice stepping into the engineer's shoes and I liked almost all questions. The one where, where it was a bit stupid, but that was okay. And see you around next year on Pure Pitwall. <laughs>